Welcome along guys, but it's day two of the tour adventure. We did the trail box yesterday. Uh, that's it, that's it. <laughs> Today, me, Womble and Lyndon are heading up to Rhonda. And we're close. You are close, you are close. Yeah! Ah! It's steep here, isn't it? Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Set it go, momentum and all that. You alright? <laughs> that's a fair on drop though, isn't it? Don't look! Take it oh, away, oh. look at that. Yee-hoo-hoo! Nice little restaurant on the lake now. That looks pretty good, doesn't it? That's a, that's a seafood paella for you. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. What a morning's riding. Beautiful bite to eat. Oh, yeah, bar. I'll go down. I'll see you down at Linden. Oh, I've got to try and get Should it have on. pushed it out before you got on it. Not bad. <laughs> Just, that was a lovely lunch. Best paella I've had, I think that is probably. So it's a dam. We're on a dam. The whole thing's a dam. Ah, it's all the big dam. Look down there. It makes you feel a bit strange. Oh, it's just a carp, is it? Big fish. So have a look at the carp. There's some over there, look, three of them over there, coming this way. There you go, there you go that big one. Bloody jaws. Part of what we're doing today is Lyndon wants to go out and find some different routes to add to what he has already. And we've already found that epic off-road route back there before lunch. That's on the list now <laughs> for future tours. So we're going to find other ways. You know, this is a bit of an exploratory mission for him today and we're just tagging along. An expedition. Look at that! I'm going to owe Bruce a fortune at this rate. It charges his fiver every time he uses blooming catchphrase. It's almost prehistoric, isn't it? It's very prehistoric, is the word. I could just imagine some dinosaurs <laughs> going across the plains over there. Look at this. Incredible. Oh, remember how to turn. If I'd known we're doing this, I would have put it in off-road mode, to be honest. Oh, I might stop and put it in off-road mode. This is uh, this is getting a bit more interesting now. I'm going to stop and put it in duro mode. I didn't realise we were doing all this. You want to hurry up, don't you? Sorry, I put it. I stalled it now. It's putting away in second, that's the trouble. <laughs> hey, ho, ho. So I was just pulling away and I just put it in, if you, I put it in off-road mode. Have you done that? Yeah, I've already done it. On the, on the move. Spin it round. I'm going for an explore here. Yeah? Don't drop it. I'll stay sat down actually. <laughs> there you go. Turn around up there. <sighs> Just the turning round. Oh, are we? Yeah. Ah. <laughs> uh, this is interesting, isn't it? Keep it upright. I like a couple of noobs now, don't we? Let me just come in front of you. And now I'm stuck. Oh, come on. We're back out on the main road now. This will take us to Ronda, about 30 kilometres outside of Ronda. So I think we're taking a direct route now, so we have a bit of fun in Ronda tonight, get a reasonable hour, because it's half five already. So we'll catch you again in Ronda. See you in a bit. We've made it, Ronda. Oh wow, look at that. Look down there mate, that make you go dizzy. Run and jump onto the step. Oh, look down there, stand up here. Look there. Come on, stand up here then. I trust you two. Great. That's a long way down, isn't it? Yeah, right, right. <laughs> 
So this is our hotel, so we can have a beer. Like, oh, so that's the hotel just there, is yeah, it? Oh, it. lovely. It's amazing, the isn't it? Is the rural bit. What a place. Look at that view. Absolutely incredible. And look how far down that is. Oh. I can't get in. I ain't got the key. Come in. Oh, I see you pushed the beds together. <laughs> Not having none of that. Oh, look at this. Look at the view. Look at the view out of here. <laughs> and there's the gorge. Look at that. What, what a view. Has it got a B day? Turn that up. No, no pushing now. I don't want to fall out of there. Thank you. Look at the bridge. Look at that. It's incredible. Oh, that was, that's that woman who jumped there. Have you heard about that? There was a woman who had this room and then she fell out the window and it's been she's haunting the room, supposedly. And there's a, yeah, we'll come back later on from dinner and she'll be pointing at us. They've probably got two pictures, they can swap them over <laughs> just to freak you out. And she'll be facing towards us. Hang on a minute. Well, we've got photographic evidence that she was pointing away when we went out to the bar. There's a bee day in a bath. It's got a squirter. It's got a Norris McWhirter on it. Look at that. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. The bar, yeah. Ah, lovely, thank you. There they are. So is it Irish pub tonight? Irish pub. It's all gonna go wrong. Gonna get messy. Messy at the Irish pub. Find a bank, get some money for beer. Yeah, you're not be banking hard for tonight. But you might be watching a bum go up and down next year. Little fish cardboard box. <laughs> oh yeah, rocking in <laughs> Ronda, rocking in Ronda. <laughs> Morning, sleeping beauty. Pretty spectacular, that, isn't it? It's a hell of a man bun. <laughs> Sleep alright, Linda? the heads. Alright, actually fine, yeah. I woke up quite early and I was like, oh, you know what, I actually feel quite fresh this morning. Done me good. Done me good that beer last night. <laughs> I woke up thirsty as hell though, so that orange juice looks rather tasty. Don McGow, and that is actually on the uh, Linden Stress Buster tour. So it's one of the hotels they use on the Stress Buster, so you can come and stay here as part of the Stress Buster Linden does. And speaking of Linden, there he is. Having his breakfast. Give us a wave. No? No, okay, don't, don't give us a wave. Well, right to the edge, feet touching the concrete. Feet forward, both feet touching the concrete. Yeah, it's because you've got big feet. <laughs> That is a long way down. Yeah, apparently this whole bridge was built in 19... 1793. Took 40 years and 50 people died in its construction. <laughs> oh, they died of old age. Yeah, they didn't, there's nothing to do with accidents. They all died of old age. <laughs> 1753. How do you even go about building something like that back then? So the plan's going to be head over to those mountains, there's a nature reserve over there, um, Smurf Village, there's the whole town painted blue for the Smurf movie, and they haven't bothered repainting it, there's a blue town, <laughs> and the nature reserve, and then we do a big loop, back, that, back to the villa, back to HQ, and then we've got a flight at 9 o'clock and we're going home. 
That's it, the trip's nearly done. Turn it on. Off into the sunshine and the mountains. Hey mate, got some, you've got some nice bits of glass here for you to admire yourself. Oh yeah, I look good on a GS. <laughs> that says something, can't <laughs> No, I, I look shit on a GS, doesn't suit me, doesn't suit me at all. Look terrible. It's got a bit of a pop this as well. I'd like to hear Bruce's actually, because Bruce has got the Acura can on it. I bet with the Acura can on, I bet it actually sounds rather nice. Can you just stop going on about GS's? Oh, that's all we're going to hear from now on, isn't it? GS this, GS that. A374. This one. I think this is taking us out into those mountains. For some more stunning roads and stunning scenery. Right? Oh, this is the National Park. Ah, uh, is it? The National Road Track. I believe Yogi Bear lives here. Jellystone Park. I'm Yogi Bear, you're Boo Boo, mate. Oh, what did he used to say, Yogi Bear? He used to have like a little catchphrase, did he? Oh, yabba dabba doo! <laughs> That's Flintstone. <laughs> that was the Flintstones. That was Mr. Flintstone. What did he used to go? Okay, Boo Boo. Boo Boo. Okay, Boo Boo. No, okay. Hey, it could be your new nickname, that, mate. Boo Boo. Never mind one ball, Boo Boo. Look at these roads, man. Where are you, Boo Boo? I can't even see you. Give it some beans, Boo Boo. Give it some beans. I haven't quite woken up yet. I'm trying to. I'm trying to adjust my head at the moment. I'm a struggling a bit. Put your head in the game, Mr. Boo Boo. These roads are incredible. This is, oh, I can imagine the supermotos down here. Be absolutely awesome, wasn't it? Just, it's pretty awesome on these. At least these didn't have off road tyres, that'd have been better. I'm sure the views are fantastic, but I can't look at them because I'm in race mode. change down. A couple of HPs. Give it the HP source. Oh, wow, look at this. Amazing. This is beautiful. What a road! Oh, amazing! I hope we've got a twisty section. <laughs> How could it get any twistier? especially these HPs with a slightly stiffer suspension. They're amazing. It's an incredible all-rounder. If you want a bike that can do a bit of everything. I have to say, I do see what the fuss is about. If only it had a supercharger, I'd be all over it. It's no wonder the Spanish are so good at racing when they've got roads like this everywhere. Absolutely no surprise, so many world champions come out of Spain. I think we lost those two. <laughs> we 
<laughs> what a bit of road. Like that one. That's amazing, isn't it? Here they come. All right, boo boo. <laughs> boo boo. That's a bit of road that, wasn't it? Oh, lovely one. I can you imagine that on the Super Oh, it'd be spot on. Well, look at the view here. It met the front, came right round, didn't it? Right round, you was out of the seat. It met the front, and I'm like... Off again. Look at the view though, look. He's <laughs> <laughs> It's probably because it stepped out, you probably weren't being smooth enough. Don't give it too much coming out the bends when it's cranked over. 